Alright, what's going on guys? It's Flame, and welcome back to another Black Ops Cold War video. In today's video, we're not really doing anything special. That is mainly because I'm currently trying to unlock the crossbow, which has been out for a bit now. Um, they accidentally released it in the shop at one point, and uh, people were able to get a hold of it, and then they removed it, and then they gave it back, like, literally a couple days later, and it was weird. But I haven't personally used it yet. So I want to unlock it and then be able to use it for a video, which will most likely be tomorrow. In terms of progress on the battle pass, I'm tier, like, I'm about to hit 45. I'm really goddamn behind on this, so I really need to get my ass in gear and uh, try to get to tier 100 because, yeah, I don't want to waste my money. And if we go over to the uh, <coughs> the crossbow, you can see I'm 5 out of 15. So going to make a bit of progress in this video and then... Hopefully close it out tomorrow, or tonight even. I don't know, we'll see. But hopefully finish that out and then have a video on this tomorrow. So definitely stay tuned for that. But yeah, you guys showed an absolute ton of support on yesterday's video. Um, my return to uploading after my like one week hiatus. So that really does mean a lot to me. I'm, I'm very glad that you guys stuck with me. And yeah, hopefully the content is, uh, is coming back to its normal rotation of uploads. So... Thank you all so much for the support. If you're new, don't forget to subscribe. Drop a like if you enjoy the video. Hit that post notification bell so you never miss an upload. Uh, and yeah, let's just hop into the game. Alright, so basically, if you read the title of this video, you know that I'm playing hardcore. You can see here, and I'm actually using the Farah right now. So basically, the reason for that is the challenge to unlock the crossbow is get three kills with a three one-shot medals with a gun that has no attachments in 15 different matches that is a mouthful oh shit sorry teammate my bad my bad so that's a mouthful basically what you have to do holy shit that's a beautiful aim right there basically what you have to do is get those one shot kill medals which you know you can get with a sniper or okay well that's all three that i need so <laughs> so now i'm just gonna swap over to the regular far that's what i've been doing um, so yeah, you have to get those one-shot kill medals, which basically just means one-shot the enemy. And it has to be on a gun that doesn't have any attachments. Um, unfortunately, you can't leave the game. Um, in Modern Warfare, you'd be able to complete whatever challenge you had to do for the game. And then just back on out. Uh, and, you know, no problem. Counts to your thing. Save a lot of time. All good. In this game... You cannot do that, and I'm going to get kicked for TK if I keep this up. So yeah, basically, and the reason I'm using the Farah is basically just because, you know, at some point down down the road, I'm going to want to unlock DM Ultra for the DLC weapons in this game. So I figure, hey, why not, while I'm working on this challenge, equip the Farah to do these one-shots since it's hardcore. Everything literally everything one shots unless it's like the mac 10 or something but everything one shots so i might as well just make some progress on this gun while i'm at it so that's what i'm doing basically um i've seen a lot of stuff about the crossbow already to me it looks like it's a lot of fun obviously unfortunately there are no special uh, attachments for it because the Modern Warfare crossbow had different tipped arrows. You could get gas uh, arrows, like poisonous gas arrows, and uh, explosive tips and stuff like that. And just a bunch of stuff that would make it really cool and unique. Unfortunately, it doesn't have that in this game. But honestly, it does look a lot, like a lot of fun. So I definitely want to try it out. Um, another thing is I also have to uh, unlock the different melee weapons. Where is this kid? Oh, they're all behind me. Okay. So yeah, I have to unlock all those new melee weapons that I haven't even touched because they weren't even out when I was playing frequently, I suppose you could say. We have the uh, shovel, which was originally like the most shit melee weapon this game, not even this game, COD has like ever had because it was a two shot. They buffed it, so now it's usable. And then there's the machete. I don't. I haven't even used the sword, which has been around for a hot minute. So yeah, I gotta try. Uh, I gotta try that out. So I got a lot of stuff to do in the game. Obviously, um, 
which feels like chores at this point, but hey, I'm just here for the ride. Hopefully, I can also hit level 200 before the end of the season. I assume that there's going to be a double XP, double battle pass, and double weapon weekend, or maybe just double XP, double battle pass at the end of the season. And if there isn't, that's not going to be very ideal, to say the least, but yeah, that's what I'm working on right now, so you guys will probably see a video on uh, the crossbow tomorrow, and I'm actually really excited to try it out. Get that guy. The one-shot kills are really easy, um, and it would have been nice if the no attachment part of it wasn't part of the challenge because basically what I would have done is just sniped which is what I always do already so wouldn't have even mattered oh I'm screwed yeah okay but since you know you have to have no attachments we already know how slow the snipers are in this game with the full ADS attachments so, when there is no attachments, it is awful. So yeah, hardcore is just the easiest way to do this, even though it's kind of ruining my mental state. Not really, it's not that bad. So, yeah, that's basically what I'm up to. Um, I also hit a bunch of clips the, uh, the last two days that I've played. Um including uh, my first ever triple on this game, like triple collab. So that was awesome. So I'm kind of just building up a bunch of clips and uh, I'm gonna attempt to, I've already got a montage that's nearly complete, so I'm hoping to release that soon. Um, but yeah, I, I'm gonna stack those up to make like a sniping highlights video. Hopefully in the near future. I also want to make some videos on some of the new Mastercrafts that are in the game. Specifically the Pink Milano. Basically, um, they released a Pink Pellington. I made a video on that uh, a while ago. But I just really like the variants like that because when you spend money on these variants, which can literally only be used for one gun, you want it to at least feel like it's worth it and so when you get those ones that are like pink or some sort of flashy color or even reactive or have that special inspect that's really what seals the deal for it and i think that uh treyarch has done a lot better of a job making the variants in this game compared to uh infinity ward on modern warfare but no, that's a whole different topic so yeah Lots of plans for the future. Definitely excited to continue the, you know, video making grind. Um, and I'm gonna just keep, you know, grinding away over here and hopefully get to unlock the uh, crossbow. That guy just walked into my bullet. But yeah, that's gonna do it for this video. Hope y'all enjoyed. Have a great rest of your day and until next upload, see ya. Peace.